So, you know, we all got that one friend that won't follow instructions, you know, like, like well, I'll give you a good example. That's this fella out there on the YouTube world, and he goes by several different names, or has down through the years. See, I've been knowing him for 14 years or so, maybe 15, I don't know, a long time. And uh, when I first got knowing him, he was going by 1963 Impala two-door, but then he changed his name to... Something else, I think Waylon Wire, and then it was Ken Coates, and it was Coach Grafton, and oh, just a whole bunch of different names. Grafting, <clears throat> something else, Grafting, all about Grafting. Anyway, so I told everybody I'd give them a free sticker, pay the postage and everything, you know. All I gotta do is send me their address. Gave them a, put their address, put their address thing right down on the on the YouTube thing, you know, and said, just send me an address to that cheer and I'll send you one. Well, here's, here's Kendall, Kendall Pig. He's up in uh, New York. He sent me his address. Here's, here's Ernie Waltman. He's, uh, I shouldn't be showing you their address, but er, let's just say it. Ernie, he's up in uh, Palmyra, Maine. And, and here's, uh, here's Robert Rhodes. He's from Pennsylvania. Yeah, they all sent me their address. And I got, I got their, I got their little letter and their little cards. I'm gonna cut their stickers out and send them to them. Ken <clears throat> saw a video where somebody else got a sticker. And he said, I didn't think I had to send him my address to get a sticker. I thought they would just send me one. Somebody said, good for them. And you know, he sent me stuff and I've sent him stuff down through the years. But I was thinking, yeah, I got the envelope with the sticker you sent me sitting on the counter at my house in Maine. I'm not at my house in Maine. And I went through my address book and I was looking for you under whichever name you might be under in my address book. I found Cutworm, I found Dead Eye, but I couldn't find you. And then I looked in my phone, I couldn't find you there neither. Probably for the same reason. I don't have organizational skills. If I had organizational skills, would I have been looking in a garage that looked like this? Huh? You tell me, would I? No, of course not. So all you gotta do is send me your address. Wait a more. So I sent him an email this morning and I said, please send me your address because I can't find it. So I just thought just to, just for the sake of making sure he don't feel left out, I'm making this video. So in case he don't get a chance, you know, he's busy because he's probably doing the, he, he does that tree stuff, you know. Cuts the limbs off and glues them back on, wraps a little scotch tape around them such as that. And he might be really busy, too busy to read his email. So I thought, well, maybe if I make a YouTube video, somebody will tell him. To look at that and send me his address. So if he does, he can get a fancy dancy little envelope like one of these with a stamp on it and might get a personalized letter from me. I don't know. You know, because sometimes I don't write them letters. I just call them up and say, hey, what you up to? And we talk and stuff. But that's all I'm going to say about that. I hope y'all are having a nice day. Honey Baby's going to be painting the bottom of the boat today because she broke a sewing needle. She's going to be working in the Honey baby, she shed, and she said, I broke sewing needle, and I don't want to drive to town to get one yet. And she said, uh, I don't have anything to do tomorrow. I said, well, you are in luck. She likes to paint. I said, you are in luck. I got some of this, some of this, I don't know how you pronounce this, glove it or glue it or something like that. You can't see that because of sunlight, can you? I got a can of this. It's epoxy, and it has to be mixed up. So I'm gonna mix it up a little bit, and we're gonna we're gonna put some of that on there. I'm gonna let her paint it because she's a good. She's a better painter than me, and she likes it better than me. So I got to find a sharp implement and cut a bunch of these and send them out. So I'll get on with that. Uh, all right, all right. Anything y'all want to add? It's your opportunity. Go ahead. Listen. I don't hear anything. Okay. Talk to you later. Have a nice day.